warm up, just shake those hands up, shake it out. You've just woken up big circles forward. Big circles, big circles for four, for three, for two, for one and back for four, for three, for two, for one. Right arm up and switch, but really open out. So you stretch and open and stretch and open in three, in two, in one. Now reach up and hold it here. Just hold it. Feel that pull in your side for four, for three, for two, for one. Up and over to that other side. Feel that pull here for four, for three, for two, for one. Walk your legs together. Keep your arms up nice and straight. We're just going to throw our arms down and come up. And as you come up, you engage those core muscles. Let's go. Give me five. Stretch. Good. For four. Drop it down. For three. Even in this, try to shift your weight back into your heels. For two. Last one here. For one. And let's go side to side. Up and across for one. Up and across. Good. Drop. Squeeze that oblique. And over to the other side. It's a stretch and a squeeze. Really pulling those arms up. For three. Up and across. Two. Up and across, one into the center. Roll those shoulders back, quick heels to bum, and let's get ready for 10, nine, for eight, for seven, for six, for five, four, for three, for two, for one. Shake it out and let's grab our light weights. We've got to go straight in today. There's a lot, 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 lot of stuff going on. It's high, heavyweights, lightweights, everything. So let's just start you off here. Shoulders down, chest is high, tummy muscles tight. We're just going to punch across for one just slow two and three and four and five and six and seven let's go eight and nine and ten ten more tummy tight for ten long arms nine for eight for seven for six for five for four for three for two for one punch forward one and two but twist your body and three and twist those weights at the front good for eight for nine, for ten, ten more, for ten, for nine, for eight, for seven, for six, for five, for four, for three, for two, for one, top corner, one, and two, and three, energy four, and five, just warming up six, and seven, and eight, and nine, and ten, ten more, for ten, for nine, for eight, reach for seven, reach for six, for five, four, for three, for two, for one, we hold it here. We tap it in and out, in and out for one, in and out. Good, tap and tap, shoulder blades. Think about your shoulders. Tap it in, squeeze it out, tap it in, squeeze it out for more, for four and in, for three and in, for two and in, for one and hold it here. We're gonna come up into a V. And then we're going to come down and then we're going to come up into a W. So it's, it's close to our shoulders, then far away for 10. Let's go for here and here and here and here. It's a V, a W, a V, a W. Stay there, four and W and three and W and two and W and one. And take a breather, putting your light weights down. We're going straight in now. I want you to grab the heaviest weights you've got. We've got three full body exercises before we move on to isolating into our back. So I want you to grab your heavier weights, as heavy as you can. You're gonna roll those shoulders back for me. You're gonna come into a squat. We're gonna drop down. We're gonna upright row, putting those dumbbells back down, bicep curl and a shoulder press. That is all I want. Three moves in one, shoulders down, chest high. We go for 12, drop it down for one, and upright row, drop it down. Bicep curl, shoulder press, good. And all the way down, it's down. And row, and down, and curl, and press for two, good. Take it down, and row it up, down, and curl, and press, and down, and drop, and row, and drop, and curl, good. Nice and steady, once you get that movement, you've got it, it's a curl, and a press. Stay with me, drop it down and row, and drop, and curl, and press. Good, take it down, five more. We row it up, we curl, and press. Let's go for four, drop it down, row, and drop, and curl, and press. Good, last three, take it down, 
we row, we drop, we come, we press. Good, two more here. Drop and row and drop and curl and press. Last one, we go, we drop, we row, we drop, we curl, we press. Dumbbells down on the floor, unless, wait, listen. If that isn't crazy challenging for those reps, then keep your weight and stay exactly where you are until we get the higher weight. We're gonna go into just an upright row now for 20. It's fast, shoulders back, chest is high, we row for one, two, three, good, four, and five, and six, and seven. Bring those elbows high for eight, and nine, and 10, 10 more for 10, for nine, for eight, for seven, row for six, for five, for four, for three, for two, for one, Quick breather, then we shoulder press it out. Arms are here, it's 20 when you're ready. Four, three, two, one. Let's go for one and two, three and four. Push for five and six, good for seven and eight. For nine, for 10, 10 more for 10. For nine, for eight, for seven, for six. Squeeze for five, for four, for three, for two, for one, dumbbells by your side, roll your shoulders back. We go into our curls for 20. Dumbbells by your side, not on the ground. We curl for one and down, for two and down, for three, all the way down. Your arm is totally extended at the bottom. So each rep is a full rep. Good, seven and down, for eight and down, for nine and down, for 10 and down. 10 more for 10 and down, for nine, and down, let's go for eight, and down, and seven, and down, let's go for six, and down, for five, and down, four more, four, and squeeze, for three, and squeeze, for two, and squeeze, last one, in one, and squeeze. Now, if, you, if, you're, on, if you're with your heavier weights, stay with them. We're here now, dumbbells are gonna be on our shoulders, palm to palm, so your palms are looking at your ears. You're gonna give me a super deep squat, tummy muscles nice and tight. You're gonna drop down as deep as you can. You're gonna come up to the top, and then you're gonna press when you get to the top. Dumbbells stay on your shoulders the whole time, and I want 12. So core is strong, abs are tight, let's go! Dumbbells on those shoulders, tummy tight, drop it down. Stop and press, that's one, let's go. Down, up, and a press. That's two, stay with me, drop and up and a press. That's three, stay with me, drop and up and press. That's four and drop and up, tummy tight, press. That's five, shift your weight into your heels. So you're really working your bum, drop it down, push and press, good. And drop and up and press. We're halfway through, six more to go, drop. Stop at the top, press, good, give me five. Up and press and down and squat. Let's go for four. Squeeze and down and press. Keep those dumbbells up high. Press it up. Last three. Up and press and down and drop and up and press and down and drop and up. Press it up. One more here. We squat, we come up, we press and dumbbells come down, roll your shoulders back. If you're switching weights up, coming into your lighter weights now for me, we're going into that shoulder press, but palm to palm. So I want 20 here. Core is strong, one last standing exercise and then we're onto your back. Core is strong and let's breathe. For one, two and three, good. Four, stretch for five. You can always go down in a weight, doesn't matter. Seven, for eight, for nine, for 10, 10 more, for 10, for nine, for eight, for seven, for six, for five, in four, in three, in two, in one, and breathe, dumbbells down. Take a breather, last move, and that is it. And then we're isolating your back. So last move, engaging your legs for now. Grab hold of your dumbbell. We'll start with that right leg. It's 10 on each side, shoulders down, chest high. We're gonna take a long lunge, and bicep curl as we go back, and then step up. That is it, but I want a really nice long lunge. 10 on that right leg, 10 on that left. In four, in three, in two, in one we go. It's one, we curl, drive it up, good. It's two, and drive it up, nice. It's three, good, as deep as you can with that back leg and as long as you can, four. 
take it long for five you're halfway through it's five and step it up it's four and step it up good let's go for three and step it up take it back for two bring it in and one and switch other leg there's no rest in between shoulders down chest high we take that left left back for one nice and long bring it forward shifting as much weight as possible into the heel of that front right foot as light as you can on that back leg i know you're bending it but as much weight is shifted forward give me four more here and we get a little breather for four good nice and long for three bring it up nice and long for two bring it up nice and long for one and roll those shoulders back you can put your weights down quickly and have a little breather we've got two quick cardios i am really sorry two really quick cardios so we're going to do weighted star jump and burpees just 10 burpees and it's entirely up to you what you do so burpees we're either here jump back jump in jump out we don't even need to get our chest to the floor or if you don't want to jump today drop step step in in reach up so let's go for our 10 quick cardio today we'll wake you up in four let's three ladies in two everyone ten burpees drop jump jump one doing it at your pace as well don't worry two you're either jumping or you're stepping three I very rarely ask for burpees for you but today it's five five more here and you're done for five drop out in and up good out in and up last two it's out it's in it's up last one out in up and breathe did you do them did you do them i couldn't see because i was doing them grab your dumbbells for me and let's get ready 20 star jumps and then your cardio is done it's kind star jumps with cardio dumbbells are here core is nice and strong 20 little reps in five four three two one let's go one Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, halfway, ten, ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Woo! Grab a sip of water. Heart rate should be going mental. And now I'm bringing you back down to earth. And I want you to keep hold of your lighter weight for our first move. And then we're going to go up. So let's start off here. We're going to go with a lateral raise. So we're going to have a micro bend in our elbows. Dumbbells are slightly in front of our body. So they're here. And we're going to micro bend them and just bring those arms up here, shoulder height, and then back in to center. We go for 15 reps. Take a breath in and out. Woo! Let's go. It's up for one and down good inhale and exhale good inhale and exhale good inhale and exhale stay with me bring it up good stay with me bring it up and lower it down good let's bring it up nice this is seven amazing stay there this is eight good let's go for nine brilliant almost there this is ten good if this feels light you can always go up I don't think it feels light five more it's feeling heavy for me with the twos for three good four sorry this is three two more here ladies and we're moving straight on into good and your last one here bringing those arms up and we're going heavier if you didn't go heavier i want you to go heavier now one way one way only we're going heavier tummy nice and tight you're gonna just bend oh bend forward from that hip you can have your hand on that leg in front that arm is nice and long tummy muscles tight we're going to come into a row and i want you to twist around in that row and as you come down i really want you to let that arm loose all the way down so really lengthen it up and lengthen it on the way down let's go for 15 tummy muscles nice and tight just to give you an eye if it feels too light you can always put two dumbbells in one hand if that feels better if you really want to go all out okay so let's get ready core is nice and strong dumbbells here and let's row it up for one 
and down for two and down remember that twist three and down for four and down remember your whole time you're sucking your tummy muscles in as you row it up you're trying to get that elbow to your spine it comes back and up but that shoulder is away from your ear so don't let that shoulder go anywhere close to your ear good two more here for two lovely last one is one and we switch we switch it here tummy muscles tight leaning down on that right leg dumbbells in that left hand you let that arm drop all the way down it's loose and you come up and round for one and switch and two and down and three and down and four with a twist all the way down five look at all that movement you've got as you rotate through that spine you can come so much higher and so much lower good stay with me row it up drop it down four more for four all the way down for three all the way down for two all the way down for one good come up take a breather let's grab our lighter dumbbells reverse flies and then we're coming back into your back we're almost on the mat we're nearly there okay so shoulders down chest high reverse flies are, again dumbbells are out in front of your body here and from here we're going to row we bring them back but look we're going to be down i don't want this we're not coming up with it so you're staying down here as low as you can tummy muscles tight the only thing that's moving is your arms squeezing your shoulder blades together that's it you got it okay let's get ready in four in three in two in one let's go for one and down good two and down really amazing for your posture for the upper back here for three and down good for four and down let's bring them up for five good and i want 10 more here you've got it 10. the sweat is actually ticking tickling my nose nine keep going for eight good let's go for seven squeeze it up for six good squeeze it up for five we're almost there squeeze up for four lovely squeeze up for three good let's go for two one more here ladies for one come up roll those shoulders back and bring your heavier weights one more time heavier weights and then we've got another move and we're coming down to the mat so core is strong now we did our row where we went round like this we're going to go into a wide grip row now so again you're going to be here let that arm hang loose and you're going to bring it back but you're going to keep that elbow that elbow's wide it's away from your body so let's go tummy tight core is strong you need to use your core here because we don't want to be like this we need to be like this so there's no pain in your lower back core is strong abs are tight and let's go for one and down two and down three and down good four and down get a bit lower low down for five good because think about your back six think about using your back just ten here seven let's go for eight good let's go for nine row it up for ten and switch at the bottom straight into ten for one and down for two and down for three and down Four. again that shoulder is away from your ear and you're trying to get that elbow to your spine four more for four and down for three down for two and down for one and down now roll those shoulders back get rid of that dumbbell and take your lighter ones last one standing but there is another one unfortunately for your back on the mat we're gonna go here I want your elbows wide core is strong we're gonna come in we twist those dumbbells round as we come in come out and press it up and let's down and in and out and press it up stay with me 10 more here it's in and out and up good let's go for in and out and up keep those elbows high it's in and out and up and as you do that twist to the front you'll feel your shoulder blades twisting in good and up five more let's go for five and out and press and down let's go for four and out and press and down let's go for three tap it out and press and down let's go for two tap it out and press and down your last one here and out and press it up and dumbbells down and breathe come down to the mat that's it grab some water i don't know if it makes you happy coming down to the mat or not but we're going straight into a back exercise on the mat so 
We're going to have one dumbbell with us and we're going to go into a renegade row and I'll show you where we are. Oh, bead on my mat. So we're going to be here. You're either balancing on your weights like this or if it doesn't feel comfortable, you can always have one hand down and just get rid of one weight totally. I want your tummy muscles nice and tight, core is strong and we're going to row and bring that dumbbell up for one. We're going to stay on one side for 10 and then we're going to go on the other side for 10. I want it controlled and slow and really thinking about that row. So we're conscious of that row. Let's go. In four, in three, in two, in one. We row it up. It's one. Controlled on the way down. You don't let that dumbbell drop. You control it. And I want your hip to end up facing the mat. Four. Good. We're almost there. Halfway at five. Slowly down. If your arm is flopping down, you're not controlling it. Give me four more here. You can always take that weight lighter, but really try and control it. It's three. Good. Roll it up. It's two. Last one here. Roll slowly down and take a breather. Pushing back for four. For three. For two. For one. We switch sides. It's right arm or whatever arm you did last time. Core is strong. Let's row it up. Let's go. Row up for one. And bring it down. Other side. Row up for two. Nice and strong. And bring it down for hips finish. Facing the floor. Let's go for three. And bringing it down. Let's row up for four. And dropping it down. Let's row for five. If it feels more comfortable, take those legs wider. Let's row for six. And you give me four more here. I know it's tough. Let's row for four. Lovely. Let's row for three. Push up. Two more here, ladies. Stay with me. Push up for two. And all the way down. Push up for one. And all the way down. Drop down onto your knees. Take a quick breather. Breathe for four. We've got one more in that position. We're going to do alternate. One, two, three, four. I'll show you where we are. Just rest whilst I show you. We're going to go here for one, two, three. Okay, we're going to go for ten like that. Just pull, pull, pull. You've got it. Okay, ten here. Let's push up into our high plank. Core is nice and strong for four, for three, for two, for one. We row for one, two. All the time in this one, your hips are facing the floor for four, for three, for two, for one. Roll down onto your knees, push back into child's pose and really rest. Take a lovely breather. Taking your breather. We're moving into our bum now. I would use your lighter weights, but again, if your arms don't feel super challenged, then just use your heavier weights. You do what feels good for you. So I'm going to show you the position. We're going to set ourselves up in a lunge position. So we're going to have one leg out in front. I'll show you from the front and the side. And our dumbbells are going to be here. So this is our setup position. Dumbbells are here. You can't see them because they're blue and my mat is blue. But they're here. Dumbbells are here. Foot is there. We're going to come here. We're going to go into a shoulder press. Then we're going to drop the weight down and kick that other leg back. The foot is flexed. So we kick it back and then we bring it back through and we press it up. So it's a bit of a weird movement, but it's really great for your core and it's a really great way to learn to move our body in a different way to challenge yourself. So let's get started. And I want 12 here. We breathe, four, three, two, one, let's go. We press the dumbbells up, drop them down and kick that leg back through. Now bring that foot forward, let's go. This is two, bringing that foot as far forward as you can and using those core muscles, Think about your tummy muscles as you bring that leg forward. You really need to use them as you kick it back and as you bring it forward. Good. Stay with me. Drop and kick and stay there. Good. Drop it down and go at your own pace. Do what feels good for you. Push it up. Drop it down. Kick it back. Bring that leg forward. Nice. We've got four more. Good. Let's go. Forward. Punch up for four. Drop, kick it back, really extending those tummy muscles and then squeezing them. This is three and forward, push up. We've got two more here. This is two. Good, last one here, push up. Dumbbells down, kick that leg back, bring it forward. Get rid of those dumbbells. Coming down here, 
staying with that same leg, I want you to come onto your left elbow. So you're here on that left elbow and that right leg is back. Core is strong. And from here, we're going to tap knee to elbow and just kick that leg back. So it's in and extend. As you go, bring that knee in. I want you to suck your belly button in and up. Let's go for 12, in four, in three, in two, in one. Tap and one, good. Flex that foot, two. Bring it in, pick it out for three. Shifting as much weight as possible in to that right hand. If that left leg is working, that right hand is taking weight if you can. Naturally, you're gonna wanna shift to that left but try and shift your weight over to that right side, driving that right hand into the mat. Two more, one. Last one here, two. Now hold that leg out, flex that foot, point that knee to the ground and pulse it up for me. Toe taps and up for one, toe taps and two. Bring it up for three and down, for four and down, for five. Shift your weight to that right side much as you can good let's go now hold it at the top and pulse it out for 20 one two three four squeeze your glute five six seven eight nine ten nine eight seven six five four three two one and breathe push back into child pose reach your arms forward just get your mat to wear your dumbbells off of your mat for me for a second and breathe for four for three for two for one, we're going into a set of press ups. You can do them on your knees or on your toes, whatever feels good for you. I want you to focus on coming down as deep as you can. Tummy muscles tight. If you want to challenge yourself, come up onto your toes today. Otherwise, stay here and we're going to drop it down for 10. Let's go for 10 and up. For nine, push up as low as you can. Push up. For seven, push up. Let's go for six. Push up. For five, push up. Let's go for four. Push up for three, push up, let's go for two, push up your last one here, push up, push back, stretch those arms forward and breathe, breathe for four, breathe for three, breathe for two and breathe for one and set yourself up, other leg, I'm doing it from the front now, so your dumbbells are here, your core is strong, let's go, let's finish this off, you're nearly done, so our dumbbells are here, we come into a press, we press those dumbbells up. You do it on the side, it's just so you can see me, so you can see from the front, do it wherever it's comfortable for you. So press it up, drop it down, and kick that leg all the way back. Bring that leg forward. We press it up, exactly what we did on that side, but on the other side, okay? In 451, let's go. Drop it down, kick, and forward, and press those dumbbells up. We drop it down, kick back. Use your tummy muscles, kick it up. Drop it down, kick it back, and bring it forward, up, and down. Slow it down if it feels too fast, or stay with me, push it up. Or if I'm too slow, speed it up and forward. Drive up, it's five, good. Stay with me, drive for six, and we're halfway through. We bring it back and forward. Every time you bring that knee forward, think about knee in, it's a crunch, and up. Good, drive it back, bring it forward, four, drop it down, drive it back, bring it forward, three, good, kick it back, bring it forward, it's two, drop it down, kick it back, bring it in, drive them up, drop them down, kick it back, let's do one more here, one, and down, and kick it back, get rid of those dumbbells, this time that right arm is down, tummy muscles tight, you're going to bring that knee to the hand and kick it straight back. As you bring it in, you tuck that tailbone under. You see, curve that back for one. Take it back. Two. Take it back. Three. Take it back. The more you can crunch those abs in, the more you're using them. Good. Give me six more here. Six. And then there. Five. Good. Bring it in four. Let's go for three. Drive it out for two. One more here for one. Now hold it here. Point that knee down to the mat. We're gonna point those toes. Toes are down to the floor. We tap it down. Lift it up for one. Down. Lift it up for two. Try not to hit your back. So keep it strong. Four and down. Five and down. For six and down. For seven and down. For eight and down. Let's go for nine 
and down. Last one for 10 and down. Now bring it up and hold it here. Shift the weight into your left hand and pulse for one, two, three, four, five. Good. Six, seven, for eight, for nine, ten. Let's go ten, nine, eight, seven, six. Let's go five, four, three, two, and one. But stay where you are. There's, oh, sorry, press ups and then stay where you are. Come into your set of press ups. Tummy muscles nice and tight. I want 10 press ups. Let's go drop down for one. Push up, we're nearly done. Let's go two, good. Drop for three, stay strong. Drop for four, lovely. And let's go five, give me five more here. Five push up, four push up, three push up, two push up, and one push up. Push back into your child's pose. Take a quick breather, breathe for four, Breathe for three, breathe for two, and breathe for one. Now coming over onto your side. We're gonna just stay with that inner thigh. We've been in that on that inner thigh this week. Just a couple more here on that inner thigh. So up on your shoulder here, unless your shoulders are dead, you can always come down here. If you're here, I want nice posture. The front, the back foot, the left foot is at the back. It's driving down into the floor. The front foot is, foot is flexed. And we're just gonna lift it up and down for one, up. Down for two, for up, for three, good. Up and down for four. Bring it up for five, nice. Bring it up for six, stay with me. Seven, good, all the way down, all the way up. Eight, good, for nine, lovely, for 10. Five more, for five, and down. For four, and down. For three, and down. For two, and down. For one, and down. Now hold it here, lift that leg up, drive that leg forward. Bring it back and lift and down and forward and back and lift and down and forward and back. Stay with me, lift and down and forward and back. Let's go, we lift and down and forward and back. Five more, we lift and down and forward and back. Let's go for four and down and forward and back. You're there in three and down and forward and back. You're there in two and down, drive forward and back. You're there in one and down, drive forward and back. Now hold it here, that foot is still off the ground. You're gonna bring your hands up to your head and we're just gonna crunch this in and extend that top leg. Now, if you need to rest that bottom leg, you can. Otherwise, I want you here. And it's one, extend, two, extend, three, extend, for four, extend. It's burning five, extend, for six, extend, in seven, Extend, in eight, extend, now rest. Just roll over onto your front. If you can, I want you to grab both heels and just have a little stretch here. If you can only grab one, grab one. Otherwise, just hold it here and stretch it out. If you want more, you can come up. You can lift those legs. Just breathe for four, breathe for three, breathe for two, and breathe for one. We've got the other side and we're almost done. Let's go. We're here. Make sure you've got that energy in that leg. That right leg is behind and it's bent. That front leg lifts up. We bring it up and down for 15 up and down and up and down. Good and up and down. Stay with me. Good and down for five and down. 10 more. It's one and down and two and down three and down, energy four, and down, feeling that inner thigh, and down, for five, down, five more, for five, and down, for four, and down, can you lift it even higher, for three, and down, can you flex that foot more, and down, energy here, and down, your last one here, and down, now we lift it up, we drive that leg forward, we bring it back, we lift, and lower, it's forward, it's back, it's lift, and lower, forward, and back, and lift, and lower, good, it's forward, and back, we lift, we lower, forward, and back, we lift, we lower, three more here, and up, good, and down, and two, and back, and up, and down, last one, it's forward, and back, and up, and down, now keep that leg there, elbow up here, we bring that knee in, we extend, for one, extend, for two, Extend for three, extend, working that oblique. Extend for four, extend, let's go for five. Extend for six, extend, let's go for seven. Extend, let's go for eight. 
it's then let's go for oh that's it eight sorry my bad drop it down just bring those feet together you're nearly done we've just got one last thing to do after this but let's just quickly stretch those inner thighs they have worked crazy hard in monday session in tuesday session yesterday session they worked super hard today they work monday they work so they've really worked hard for us today so let's just stretch out those inner thighs and then we're finishing off with one last thing i want you to roll over onto your front we're doing a walking plank so we're here we're pushing up down down up up here so we start up here we're gonna alternate it starting here core is strong if you need to at any point you drop down to your knees and you finish it off i want 10 and then you're done so hold here in your plank and push up on that right hand and breathe good now coming down and down now push up with that left hand hold your plank that's two come down push up with that right good drop it down push up with that left that's four drop it down push up for five you're halfway through five more and you're done push up with that left hand nice and strong trying to keep those shoulders and those hands aligned so every time you push up that hand is underneath your shoulder trying to move the hips as little as you can don't worry if they move they're gonna move push up give me two more one more on your right one more on your left and you're done push up drop it down one more on your left now hold it here for me for 10 for nine for eight for seven for six for five for four for three for two for one drop down onto your knees push back into a child's pose breathe it out well done ladies non-stop stretch those arms forward and breathe oh my god not sure i could pack anything else into that one today roll down onto your back when you're ready and just breathe for me breathing on your back recenter yourself bring yourself back to your mat and then let's just bring one leg up and over and let's stretch it out looking towards that right side well done breathing have a nice stretch rotating through your spine releasing any tension in your spine in your back and when you're ready just roll through that center extend that right leg lift that left leg up and over and looking towards that left side and breathe breathe breathing for four breathing for three breathing for two and one rolling into center just give yourself a nice big cuddle and rolling round well done ladies so we do need to fix this problem of you working out Monday, Tuesday and Wednesday and then that huge gap. And I'm working on it. Whether you do a recorded session or whether we manage to get another session in at another time, we'll try and do that. Putting your feet down flat, cross one leg over the other and bring yourself in. Because I actually think they, three sessions a week is amazing. Like that's what everyone wants to go for. Four sessions a week is just insane. And that's like optimum, 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 optimum. But three sessions a week is, is a standard, it's great. This is good to get fitter and to stay fit. Breathing. And four sessions a week is to be a machine. Bring that in. Even if your extra session is a run or your Pilates, whatever it is. Breathe and breathe, breathe, breathe. Stretching that glute. Now I just want you to put both feet down, put your hands by your side and just push up into a really nice big glute bridge, stretching all the way up, stretching up, push and push, and then rolling down through your spine. Just rolling over onto your side, into your downward dog, ladies. Push up, stretch, one and two and three and four walk your hands to your feet or your feet to your hands whatever feels good for you <laughs> but hang low hang heavy and in your own time roll up 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 into a nice big stretch ladies oh stretching out that back let's go over to one side i really want you to take that right hand and pull that side really give it a nice pull so we're opening out all through that lat that big muscle at the back here stretch stretch it up and over and keep breathing whilst you're doing it well done 
and up and over to the other side. Stretch it up and over. Really feel that pull in the side. Open it and open it and up to the middle. Stretch up. Grab both hands. Interlock the fingers. Stretch. With your hands interlocked now, just drop down to the floor and lean forward. And when you get down there, you can release those fingers. See if you can bring those hands back between your legs and breathe for me. Now, just bending over in that inner thigh, stretch over to one foot and hold it here. Feel that pull here. Just stretch it out. And up and over to the other side. Just stretch and hold it here. Lovely. And back to the center. See if you can come down a little bit lower. And then roll up through your spine. Roll up, 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 up. Take one arm across your body. Let's just drop just stretch that shoulder and breathing here lovely breathe it out stretch into that other side and breathe it out and just rolling those shoulders back for me shaking that any tension out rolling those shoulders for forward for me hands come forward for me for four for three for two and one, take the arm back. Nice big circles for four, for three, for two, for one. Shake it out and you're done. 